All right, so today we're going to be making the simplest thing maybe on the planet. Uh, we're going to be making a PP and J. Now, the difference is though, we're actually going to, instead of the jams that are usually filled with sugars and even when they promote that, oh, we just you know put real fruit inside, they have preservatives in them, and they have tons and tons of artificial flavors and like a, you know different types of processed sugar. And we don't want that. Right now, peanut butter on the other hand, you can get all natural peanut butter and yes, there's preservatives inside of it. However, it's a little bit harder to come by than getting a kind of a natural jam. So all we're going to be doing in this episode is just making a simple sandwich and then breaking down how big that sandwich should be or those individual slices should be and it's completely amazingly fresh. The main idea of this video is to show you the comparison of jam to fruits. Peanut butter is going to always stay at 100 calories for this size, depending on the brand. Bread is going to be between 100 and 150 calories. But this set of jam here, which is around 30 milliliters, is 100 calories and has around 20 grams of sugar. These strawberries are 300 grams and there's around 100 calories. You have the apple that is around 110, 115 grams at 100 calories, and the banana around six, or six, five or six inches, 100 calories. Now this is about seven or so inches, so I'm saying about 100, 110 calories. But the choice is clearly yours. You could have something that you, you know, it may be fairly fresh, or it might be filled with tons of preservatives, tons of added sugars, and things you would ever, never want to put into your body. All right, so here we have the finished product. We have the banana and apple uh, sandwiches, which I'm going to start off with because they're the same amount of calories. As you can see, if you were just to have one slice of bread, it's around 130 calories for this particular slice of bread, the 100 calories for the peanut butter, and the banana, you're looking at around 50 to 60 calories because we didn't get all of the banana, but I took the biggest, thickest pieces, and with the apples, around half. So both of these slices on its own with the peanut butter, you're hovering around 300 calories. If you were to add a slice on top, you'd be going around 450. And if you wanted to make a completely second, uh, different slice, a second slice, you'd be looking at 600, which should leave you fairly full for breakfast or dinner. And you could probably have uh, maybe something else, another fruit alongside. The strawberries, though, as you can see, we have tons more strawberry left. I put the biggest strawberries on there to show you that you can get a ton out of uh, doing it this way. And you can make a full out another sandwich or a slice and a sandwich and you'd still have a few strawberries left over. The beauty of this is you're going to get better flavor than the jam and it's going to be much healthier for you. Alright, so this recipe or modification to the common day peanut butter and jelly sandwich hopefully works for you. It's a lot more filling and you get to actually have more nutrients. Uh, Mom, how much do you think this meal would cost? Two slices of bread or, or one? It's very economical, a dollar or less. A dollar, and uh, that's pretty awesome when you think about it. Yeah. Uh, it'll be a little bit cheaper with the jelly. Uh, I have to state that. However, again, you're getting the nutrients out of it. So I really want to, you know, kind of put that in there. Uh, anything else I can add to, to this, or do I got the mom stamp of approval? Oh, it's a very healthy meal. You make your skin looks good. And Hear that, kids? Make your skin look good. All right, if you have any comments uh, or questions, drop them in the comment section below. If you want to uh, check out the blog or the website, you can do that in the description and any other thing else that would pertain to the video. And just thank you so much for watching. Have yourself a wonderful day, evening. Morning, God bless. Oh, yeah, and if you like what I'm doing, please tweet, tumble, like, share. Thumbs up, plus, pin, or do whatever you do, and please, subscribe.